In this video, we'll see how to work with a waterfall chart. As the name suggests waterfall, how does the sales of my company grows from one place to another and the shape would be given in the form of waterfall. Not only the sales, if you want to see the profit, which is a negative profit or a positive profit, how it goes in the form of a waterfall. Let's see that. So first of all, I'm working in the workbook named as waterfall chart. The database is same global superstore 2017. You can create a waterfall chart with the help of Gantt chart. You have to use the Gantt chart method. Then only it is easy for us. So let us see. First of all, I'll create a simple bar chart. I'll pick up this subcategory into this rows, pick up this sales into this columns part. And now if you see, I'll just sort into the descending order and I'll sort into the, I'll swap the fields. Okay. So now if you observe it is in the descending order itself. Now what I want, I want to change the chart type, which is given here. So I'll select from this drop down and I'll select this option, the second last option, GAN chart. So I've selected. Now if you see the form is the waterfall in this downwards area. Now what I want to do is I want to give some color and I want to change the size also. So you can give the size and shape to this place. How do you give it? So I'll pick up the sales again and put into the size. And if you see the size have changed. If I want to give some color, I'll just pick up this color and give to this color part itself. So you see the gradient fill which is given the dark blue to the light blue itself. This is one method which you can work with. So it's very simple just within few clicks you can just create it. Now I'll show you one more example for the waterfall chart based on this subcategory now with the profit itself. So I'll just click on this plus sign and now, now I'll show you one more example. So I'll just pick up this subcategory and drop into this rows, pick up this profit and I'll drop into this columns part. So I'll get this horizontal bar chart. So I'll just swap the field. So I'll get a horizontal one, pick up and drop into the ascending order. So this is the profit chart which I've got based on the subcategory. So what I'll do is I'll first change the chart type, click on this drop down and I'll select this GAN bar. That's the GAN bar chart type which I've got. And if you see, I'm trying to build a waterfall chart with the help of this GAN chart itself. Now I need to give some shape and I need to give some color. So I can give the shape using the same profit into the size. Okay, if you see the size is getting increased and also it is going on the upward direction. Same way, if I want to give some color part, so I'll pick up the profit drop into the color part itself. Now if you see there's a, a gradient kind of fill, the color which is given, the lowest profit will be given as yellow color, the highest profit will be given as the dark blue color. So this is one method you can just create a waterfall chart with the help of can chart itself. I hope you have understood. That's all for this video.